substance which allow electric current to pass through them easily are called good conductors of electricity such as silver gold aluminum etc some substance allow electric current to pass through them but in a very little amount therefore such substance called back conductor of electricity rather than being called as insulator in fact most of the substance allow electric current to pass through them under certain condition so instead of using term conductors and insulator good conductors and bad conductors are used ma'am do liquids conduct electricity liquids which contain salt dissolved in them conduct electricity the liquid that conduct electricity are the solution of acid bases and salts in water for example vinegar solution a solution of hydrochloric acid do solids and liquids conduct electricity similarly no there are certain difference in the conduction of electricity by solid and liquids first in solids like metal electricity is carried by electrons but in liquids electricity is carried by ions second when electricity is passed through a solid then no chemical change take place but when electricity is passed through a liquid then the chemical changes take place now can you tell me what chemical effects of electric current are the chemical changes which take place in conducting liquids on passing electricity do them are called chemical effects of electric current ma'am what is an electrolyte a liquid which can conduct electricity is called electrolyte the solution of acids bases and salt in water are electrolytes ma'am what are strong and weak electrolytes a strong electrolyte is a liquid which conduct electricity very well a weak electrolyte is a liquid which conducts electricity to a lesser extent what is an electrode 